Okay, so we're out here at my family property and we have a bit of a tree of heaven uh, problem out here. So we are trying to treat the tree of heaven with a mix of triclopyr and diesel fuel. And what we're doing is the basal bark application. So we're spraying the basal bark with the solution. So um, you want to try to just minimize this application to just the tree of heaven. So <clears throat> this is a tree of heaven right here. You can see it has the um, pinately compound. And <clears throat> the one tree it's easy to get confused with that looks similar is black walnut. But the smell of the leaves is quite different from walnut. Walnut smells lemony and tree of heaven, it stinks. Um, some people say it smells like peanut butter, um, but it definitely doesn't smell as good as black walnut. Um, also, uh, the bark is a lot smoother than black walnut. Um, this is a younger tree of heaven right here. It's kind of in between a lot of multi-flora rows. Um, but you want to make sure you don't spray something that's not tree of heaven. So this right here is spice bush. Um, you can see the leaves look completely different, and uh, it also, the leaves have a different smell too. They smell kind of spicy and good. It's a nice fragrance. So anyway, we want to make sure we don't hit that. So <clears throat> this one's kind of in a tricky spot because it's surrounded by a lot of multi floor rows. But um, I just have a pump sprayer here. Um, so anyway, I just you know, get some air into that pump. And then I'm going to focus, and I'm wearing eye protection too, so you should, again, make sure you're wearing your, your PPE when you're doing this. Fortunately, we don't get coronavirus from Tree of Heaven, so we don't need a mask, but just spray the upper, maybe several inches of the bark and try to not hit anything that's you know, non-target, and you let it go. Um, some tips for this, you want to Spray it when it's under 85 degrees Fahrenheit. And also you don't want to spray herbicides when you are, um, it's been super dry for a long time. You want to have it had rain in the area for at least two weeks. But you also want to spray the herbicides when you're gonna not have rain for a little while, just so that the trees have time to soak in the herbicides. So another one I have right here, this is a much bigger tree of heaven, but this technique, you know, it says it's more effective for smaller tree of heaven, like the one I just sprayed. Um, this can still be good, so we're going to go ahead and spray this one kind of all over the base of its bark. So it'll take me a little bit of time, but. I'll do this all the way around the tree. Everything covered up pretty well. 